Send me piece yourself back together now What's your vision? Hi everyone, welcome back again to my channel and this is about Sastra <laughs> Okay, everyone, thank you so much for stopping by and to click this video and to watch me now and Today I'm going to react a new video that I got from the internet and it's very Important video to sh for me to share to my audiences and to my viewers Even if it's possible, I'm going to share it to the whole world that This from this video that we can learn a lot of things Okay, and the video is going to be about Philippines about how the government of the Philippines, how the Philippines people itself fix their tourism in their country. They fix their tourism industry in their country. This is a very good example for everyone all around the world, mostly for us in Southeast Asia, because as you know that, as we know that in Southeast Asia, uh, we have lots of tourism uh, destinations and one of our main or Suggest that are to get more tourists or more visitors come to our country and to enjoy our country, to enjoy the beautiful our country in Southeast Asia. Okay, for example, Indonesia with its Bali, with its Raja Ampat, the Philippines with Barokai, and with so many other beautiful islands and places there. In Thailand, it has Phuket, right? Chatu Cha, Kuat Arun and Malaysia it has the Kuala Lumpur itself as the main uh, uh, tourism destinations and also about the caves uh, lots of in Southeast Asia almost all of the countries in Southeast Asia use their tourism industry as one of the uh, main thing that uh, support the citizens economy okay so without any further ado everyone I will just show these beautiful inspirations how Philippines how Philippine fix tourism in their country. Without any further ado, here we go. One, two, three. Tourists! Did you know that tourists like us can be a problem? See, when thousands and thousands of tourists go to one place, they leave a lot of plastic trash behind. They leave a lot of sewage, they Agreed destroy nature one. and interrupt wildlife Cannot agree more. just to get really? that selfie. It's true. We are tourists! We are tourists! It's called over-tourism, and it's a real problem all over the world. So much that oceans can get too polluted to swim. So bad. For the first time ever, I want to show you how one country in Asia is fixing the over-tourism is... problem. Say hello to the Philippines. It's a beautiful country with over 7 million tourists a year. But after some point, their nature started suffering. So, the Filipino people and the government decided to fix it. First, they put nature over money and closed down the bays and the beaches. Amazing. They demolished buildings to make room for sand. And they cleaned the beaches here, here, and here. But this is not enough. Then, they banned many plastic bottles aluminum instead they created a sewer system to drain the sewage wow this is insane look all this piping and this work is supposed to turn this beach from like a wasteland into like an actual beach for people beautiful this is exactly what amazing. we need to support amazing they idea they replaced diesel tricycles to electric ones this is so quiet. I love the electric. They added trash cans everywhere. They protected the corals from boats. They limited the number of boats and limited the number of tourists on the island so it doesn't get overcrowded. Then they reopened. This is how sustainable tourism looks like clean beaches and clean nature to make these islands more fun forever. They went from this to Amazing. this. 
Amazing. Wow. The Philippines has a long way to go, but they're trying. And we tourists also need to try to take nothing but photographs. Agreed so much. Leave nothing but footprints and kill nothing but time. Exactly. This That's good why. tourism is the future here in the Philippines and everywhere in the world. Oh my god, it's beautiful. See you next time. Oh my week. god. Keep it up. Philippines! Oh my god, guys! This video, this short video is so inspiring. At the very first time I see this, oh my god, I got the ghost bumps and I got tear in my eyes. I mean, it's so true. It's so true. And the first thing that we have to do is just to start. That's the most important thing. That's the key. To start. Not to try, but just start it. Start from the government itself, the support, support by the government and then also by the citizens and also the, at the end then the tourists also can see how the citizens, how we really love and take care of our nature then they will also try to do the same thing. Here what, can, what I can say that this video inspire us so much and it also can be applied to many other countries in Southeast Asia that use uh, tourism as one of their industry to increase the economy of the people, of the citizens. I think that support from the government is really needed here. They need to make a program, for example, just say it, Indonesia. You know what, Indonesia used tourism as one of its uh, land to grow the, how to say this, to get more income, right? They ha we have Bali, we have Raja Ampat, I mean, we have uh, Labuan Bajo, but look at that, that those places right now, they were so polluted by so many tourists, over tourism, they throw trashes in everywhere. You know what, Raja Ampat, at the very first time we see Raja Ampat, they were just pure land, pure oceans, and you can just see the crystal clear water, there but right now just like the coral it's everything is broken just by so many ships coming and then hits the coral at the bottom of the sea and then it's not as beautiful as before and i'm afraid that in the future that it's going to be worse and i hope that before it's getting worse I hope that by looking at this video, how the Philippines fix the tourism industry in their country, it can inspire many other people. It can inspire Indonesian people as well, or even the government of every single country in Southeast Asia. This is a very good example, and I really respect and I really um, showing respect to the government of the Philippines. What I read from the comments that at the very first time, the government of the president launched this program, so many people ban him. So many people say bad him about him, negative things about him. Why they closed the Barakai Island? Barakai, I'm sorry if I'm, I'm wrong to pronounce it, Barakai Island. They closed it for several months. They don't know what is the idea, actual idea of the president by closing the, the Barakai Island. And then, after it's clean, after they clean up and set it up again, and then look at Baraka Island right now, they are just like heaven. It's amazing. And this is the thing that, I mean like, President Rodrigo, du Rodrigo Duterte has done a lot of positive things, I think, for the Philippines from the very first time. He fight with the corruptors, he say no for the corruptions in his country. And then next now he has so many good programs for the tourism industry. Although at the very first time that many Philippine people even disagree with him, but at the end, now the citizen itself themselves can see the impact, the positive impact of the program of the President Rodrigo Duterte. So it is so amazing and I give respect. 
I give a very high respect to him and I think that this is the point of having this uh, relationship, this vlog that I can share good things about Philippines with, to the whole world, to the Indonesian people, to South Asian people and then they can take some lesson, they can learn and also you guys can give more suggestions to me and then I can be more positive, I can share more positive things and I feel like I want to become the bridge from the outsiders to the Philippines mostly from the Indonesian to Philippines and it's not a mistake to learn from others no need to sh be shy but if there's positive things then we can learn hopefully that by having this relationship we can just share mutual relationship which make profits to me and also to many other people so start to think how to build a country and stop thinking bashing others hating others create something that can make yourself proud and even your country proud of yourself thank you so much for the philippines for this video department of the tourism of the philippines you guys rock really amazing thank you so much everyone for watching if you like this uh, video hit the like button and leave comments in the comment box if you want to react to another things later and also don't forget to subscribe if you are new to this channel i'll be coming back with many more interesting videos thank you for now everyone maraming salamat mahal ko kayo bye